What's up team? It is your biggest fan, The Real Casadero. In this video, what I wanted to talk about is for anybody who's looking to get into web development and you have a Windows machine. A lot of people, a lot of users out there, they're using Windows machines. And when you go on the internet and you're, you're watching people go through all these tutorials and, you're, and you see these day in the life videos, not all of them, but a lot of them are completely fictitious. They aren't based on the real experience that most people are gonna have. What you'll see in a lot of these videos is you'll see people using Mac computers, you'll come across some people who say you should use Linux, Linux is the best. This is not true. If you have a Windows machine, you can get started in web development, application development in general. Now there are some hoops that you have to jump through if you wanna build stuff specifically for Mac or iOS and stuff like that. But for the most part, to be able to go out and to build your own applications. When I say web development, I'm talking about web applications and web applications, you can run anywhere. They can run on any device. They can run on mobile devices. You can use some of the built-in features on, on mobile phones and tablets and all of this stuff. The beauty of the web app is you're not beholden to anybody. You can build something, you can put it on the internet and anybody can use it anywhere to do just about anything they wanna do. And there's a series of technologies you can use that will allow you to write something using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, the core foundation of building web applications and you can port these out and run them on any device. So you don't have to know anything super specialized. The most important part, you don't have to have a $1,000, $2,000, $3,000 MacBook Pro to do any of this stuff. You can have a, a fairly new Windows laptop, a laptop that you bought, I would say within the last five years, if you bought it new. Basically any laptop that'll run Windows 10, you can do just about anything you wanna do when it comes to building websites, web applications, online stores, e-commerce site, even applications for Android and iOS. You can do this all inside of Windows. You don't need anything special to do any of this stuff. I'm gonna hop on, I'm gonna hop on the computer and I'm just gonna show you some of the laptops you can buy. Maybe you have an older laptop and you just want a new, you want a new computer, but you don't have a budget. A thousand, fifteen hundred, two thousand dollars, three thousand dollars, something like that. You just want a computer that's gonna get you started, that's gonna be functional and capable for you to do all the stuff you wanna do. Search the internet, watch movies, but most importantly, you wanna be able to build stuff. You wanna be able to learn to build your own applications and websites and stuff like that. So let's hop over to the computer and I'm gonna show you some laptops that you can buy that will help you along your journey. And you don't you don't have to learn Mac, you don't have to learn Linux, you don't have to spend a ton of money. All right, team, so let's get to it. We're gonna go to Amazon dot com and this is super simple right you just go up in the search bar and you type windows windows 10 laptop laptop boom right here you got a hp 17 inch monitor 8 gigs of ram one terabyte hard drive 529 bucks with free delivery this is a good computer this computer is just fine it's going to come with windows 10 it's going to have everything you need and you're going to be able to do everything you need on it here you got another hp hp 15.6 this is 2015 it's got an intel i3 7100 in it 8 gigs of ram one terabyte hard drive it's got everything you need you can use this to build websites web applications you can literally go out and buy a four or five hundred dollar computer go out and start selling your services and pay for the laptop in in a in a, a a couple months some of you can even do it in a week all you need is one client that'll pay you 500 bucks to build them a website and boom you're done here's a secret that not a lot of not a lot of people talk about is that you don't have to know how to do all of this stuff one of the skill sets of the rich is the ability to use leverage like real estate investors they don't spend all of the money in their bank account to go out and buy a property what they'll do is they'll have some money saved up then they'll go out and they'll get other investors and they'll partner on a deal they're using other people's money to help them get what they want credit is the same thing you go out you get a credit card you borrow some money they give you some money you go out and you buy something and you use that to make money and you just make payments on their credit card that's that's leverage when it comes to web development you don't have to know how to do everything you just have to know how to get the clients get the customers and then you can go and you can have somebody else actually do the work and as you learn you can begin to do the work yourself or you can start working on more complicated projects and tasks but at the core of it all at the very least you can learn how to set up WordPress websites and install plugins for people. And there's people out there who make a ton of money doing that. Um, you don't have to go out and spend months and months and years and years learning web development before you can go get a client and start making some money. So anyway, let's get back to the desktop. Then down here, we've got the HP Pavilion uh, convertible touch book, 462 bucks, boom. Perfect laptop, comes with Windows 10. It's convertible so you can use it as a tablet. It has a touch screen. It'll do everything you need to do for web development. And the same with any of these other machines. If it comes with Windows 10, and it's 
got a one terabyte hard drive and more than four gigs of RAM that's more than enough power than you, than you need to get started. Check this out. We got an Asus, 155 bucks, two gigs of RAM. You can build web applications on, on this machine. Now, it doesn't have a lot of the features that the other ones have, but this machine is good enough for you to build web applications. If we go down here, we got a 14, 14 point point one full HD Windows laptop PC with Windows 10, four gigs of RAM, dual band, five gigahertz Wi-Fi. It's got everything you need. $229. You can build websites and web applications on this. So as you can see, you don't need a ton of money. The next place we're going to go, we'll go over to Best Buy. You can actually set a local store. It brings up a store right here. We can change the store, find another store. I set this store to the, the Best Buy that's closest to my house. Now we can go over here. We can go to Product, Computers and Tablets, All Laptop, Pick Up Today. This will show us all the laptops in the store that we can just walk in and buy. We can walk in and buy this laptop right here, $699. And if we find this exact laptop, somewhere else for less money on Amazon some other store somewhere on the internet Best Buy will match this price we can get it for probably even less like when I built the desktop computer the computer you see behind me here this computer you see right here when I built this machine every part in this machine was price match I was able to buy like a four or five thousand dollar machine for three thousand bucks the two monitors you can't see the monitors but I have two high definition monitors these monitors originally sold for like six hundred dollars somebody was selling them somewhere else on the internet three hundred and fifty dollars so i so instead of buying just one monitor i got two essentially for the price of one these are all windows machines that we can buy 699 bucks this i can go to the store and pick this up right now if it's on the internet somewhere else for cheaper like i said best buy will price match it and we can get it for whatever price they're selling at 299 this right here four gigs of ram one terabyte hard drive this one right here four gigs of ram 128 gig solid state drive all of these machines you see here, you can use to build web applications. You can use to, to learn software development and you can use to go out and get clients and start and start making some money. You don't need a ton of money. We go over to apple.com. From 2010 all the way up until 2016, I bought every version of MacBook that was released. They came out with a new one, that's what I went and bought. But if we go here and we go to Mac and we go MacBook, looks good, looks fantastic. But let's see what let's see what the price starts at. Starting at one thousand two hundred ninety nine bucks, you could go buy a, a computer and you can be able to do the same thing, right? Build websites and web applications. You go buy this. You could go buy a computer that'll do this for two hundred for, for two hundred ninety nine for three hundred dollars. You don't need this fancy stuff that you see all these other people out here on the internet using. All right, team. So I hope that helps a lot of you out. Again, you don't need like anything super fancy. You don't have to have the best equipment, the best tech, the best whatever. You don't have to save up and all this other stuff. If you got a couple hundred, if you got an old computer that doesn't have Windows 10, I recommend that you that you get a computer with Windows 10, but you don't have to wait and, and get a, a MacBook or go out and buy a used MacBook and be worried about whether this works or whether that works or whatever. You can go buy a brand new computer with Windows 10 installed and you can start learning software development web development today today and i showed you like you can go go down to best buy pick up a machine boom you can be off to the races today and so for those of you who are just getting started if you check out the code 365 startup lab there's five or six free courses there um, and they're not super long in-depth courses they're just they'll get you started they'll they'll put you on the road of learning html css javascript which will put you which will give you the basic foundation for learning all the stuff you need in order to build websites and web applications now i got one caveat for you. The deal is that when you start building applications and websites for yourself and other people, there is an element of creativity involved. And I covered this a little bit in the video, is that you don't have to know how to do everything. If you change your mindset and you're willing to think outside of the box and you're willing to think about the wealthiest people in the world, all you need is some leverage. If you know HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, then you can go out, you can find somebody else to do the work. What I see a lot of and what I've experienced myself, what I'm dealing with is, is this, this want, this need, this desire to be able to do everything. The problem is that you get caught up in these tutorials, you spend all of this time learning to do all of these things you don't have to know how to do all of these things what a lot of people out there need and I'm saying like e even myself maybe even you what a lot of people need is they just need they need someone to bring them the work if you are able to go out and you're able to get the clients you can take the work to these other people and they'll be infinitely grateful like imagine you in your situation like you want to build websites like maybe you know HTML CSS Java you know all this stuff already and you just want to build websites but you don't know how to go out and find clients what would be more fantastic it's somebody who's figured out that all they have to do is go out and find clients and they just 
they just emailed you or text message you or call you and say, hey, I got a client that needs a website. Can you build this thing? How much do you charge? Hey, you know, I charge, you know, 500 bucks, a thousand dollars, however much. And they go, okay, cool. I'll send you the specs and you just go to work. That's, that's what you can do. This is what all businesses do. Don't be fooled by all the hype and nonsense that you're hearing out here in the world. There's two types of people. There's employees and there's bosses, right? If you're thinking that at one day you want to be at the boss level, you don't have to wait. You don't have to go through the steps to be at the boss level. And when I say boss, I'm not talking about you bossing people around. I'm not talking about yelling at people and, and being a, and being a, I'm talking about the ability to help other people get what they want. Finding businesses, they need something, they need this service that, that you understand, that you know about, and you've got developers who need customers. They need they need projects to work on. You become the person in the middle and you piece that stuff together. And you don't need a lot to get started. That is it team. Share, subscribe, like, hit the notification bell. If there's something I missed or any questions you have, leave a comment below. I will try to answer it for you. Until next time, I'm The Real Casadero, your biggest fan. You can do this. Whatever it is you want to do, start your own agency, be a freelancer, even go out and find a job. You can do it. You can do all of this stuff. All right, team, I'll see you next time.